Hello my YouTube fans and new subscribers. Welcome to my uh, uh, a intimate view of my messy room. <laughs> yes, usually I have the I have the camera situated in a, in a uh, strategic way that you don't get the you don't get the full view of uh, just how just how uh, messy this room is. But in any case, <clears throat> so this is um, an impromptu video. Um, two things. One, um, I'm trying to um, find a way because um, we have a little money situation going on here. I wanted to make a video about uh, opening up a box of a bundle pack of, uh, of uh, excellent rivals. Uh, rivals of excellent, I should say. Uh, but um, in order to do that, you know, I, I can't be spending, you know, frivolous money, you know. I'm not a, really a kid. I even, even though I act like one. Uh, so, it turns out that uh, the the game store that I normally go to, which is in my immediate range uh, uh, reach, uh, is not interested in certain cards. As you can, as you know, I got that one card from Walmart, that, that lottery ticket card, the hundred and ten dollar card. They were not interested in buying it. I don't I don't really like to sell my only copy of something, but being the adult that I actually am. Uh, the money situation that we have right now, I needed to perhaps consider selling it. So it turns out that another person who actually is associated, excuse me, <coughs> uh, with the chess club that I go to has a gaming store a little bit further. And he was interested in it. Now, uh, you know, yesterday's meeting at the chess, uh, I should say the last week's meeting, not yesterday's, but last week's meeting at the chess club when, when I mentioned this to him and I showed it to him, he was interested. I um, didn't think of it then, but I should have taken him up on his offer because now I actually need it. But at the same time, I'm trying to provide content for, for you know, especially since I'm doing the subscribe-a-thon, you know, trying to get people to subscribe, trying to reach a thousand subscriptions by February 20th, or actually more than, I keep saying the same thing, but I, I meant to say more than a thousand because it's uh, YouTube's rule is you have to surpass that thousand threshold. So. Um, I'm currently in, sort of in contact with this uh, other game store and um, what I want to do is in order to be able to bring you this uh, opening of a bundle pack of rivals um, I'll sell the single copy of the $110 card I'll probably get like half that for it you know because they got to make their money too but this is what I'm considering doing. So, so in order to bring you some some uh, Magic the Gathering uh, openings and stuff like that, I want to uh, sort of sell one thing to get another. So that's no problem. I, I enjoy doing it. It's you know um, kind of a unique hobby trying to collect these things. In the meantime, um, this video is also I want to dedicate this video to a young chess club member friend uh, friend of mine, young guy, young kid, Nathan. Hey Nathan, Nathan was actually emailing me tonight asking me if I was going to do a video tonight so I figured I'd dedicate this to him. So yesterday's chess club meeting um, I actually played chess a little bit better than I did the week before. The week before I really did lousy. So I played chess better but uh, and my opponent, an older man, well about the same age as me I guess, uh, me and him were both uh, blundering. I, I was uh, in trouble and then I got back you know to into the game and and I was really kicking butt and Nathan came along he, Nathan's actually uh, participating in the in the tournament which I'm not Nathan came back and uh, actually won his game and uh, he was looking at our game he was he was observing our game and it was getting towards the end and I I, I totally missed a, a simple move to capture and not be in trouble for it uh, it's hard to say. Let's, let's put it this way. I could have just simply taken my opponent's pawn with my new queen and he could not capture back because the king was protecting it. But the game was going on for so long I, I just, I guess, I don't know, we were both tired. Because he didn't say it, I didn't say it, but Nathan's observing the game. He was like, why didn't you just take it? <laughs> so kudos to Nathan. Uh, he is a good chess player. I told him so. So this... Um, this video is going to be for you, Nathan. I got two things. One, and uh, to supplement, you know, while we're waiting for me to get the um, bundle pack, 
I did actually go to Walmart and pick up another one of these, and maybe uh, maybe I'll get another lottery ticket. Maybe I'll get a, a, a foil land out of these. But since I'm dedicating this uh, video to Nathan, Nathan K, nine, ten years old, um, waiting for me to do a video, I'm going to on this video because I promised Nathan that I was going to give him some lands. And Nathan was asking for lands because he doesn't have enough to create some decks that he wants to make. And uh, I said to him, "You can get them at any story, any store, you know, a gaming store." And he does get them from them, but uh, he's uh, still a little shy for some lands that he needed. It turns out that because I've been over the last few months, I've been buying a couple of things. I ended up with a lot of lands, more than I need, and I used to get them from the game store too, for free. So I thought I uh, pay it forward, and uh, since now I have a good number of lands, I got a box of lands. Um, I set aside some lands for Nathan. I told him in an email, in the email, in reply, that I have 121 cards for him waiting. So I'm going to show on this video. So if Nathan, if you're watching, if you see this video, I'm going to show you your cards right there. So in this little box, which is supposed to hold 100 cards, which actually holds more, but this box was designed to hold 100 sleeved cards, so like a commander deck, right? And it smells like school because I used the, you know, those, you know, those, the, 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 magic markers, the permanent markers that teachers use, the ones that really smell strong, I got one of those. They last forever. I had it for years. They never go bad. So, here it is. 100 basic lands plus 15 full art. You know, I labeled it. Oops. I labeled it sloppily with the... And the Nathan will be getting this, this box. Okay? So we're going to pull this out, okay, so the way this works, now I'm going to point this camera down because I can do this a little bit easier this way. So I have it separated, there's 20 of each land, uh, color, and I actually sorted through them so that you get like a a few of, of, of all the different artwork that I happen to have and and then it, as it gets to the end there's a separator a little uh, orange uh, cardstock boy that's really bright here we go orange cardstock that I separated and then there's um, the full art lands so in addition to the hundred twenty each of regular you know basic lands I'm giving you some full art lands three of one two of another I don't know you know I, I try to give you uh, the one if I had more than the other one you got more than the, you know so you get an extra one of whatever color that I had more of and then after the full art lands come some non basic lands and um, there we go so I got you know there was I don't it's not there's not a lot of them but uh, you've got uh, two evolving wilds two highland lakes and two painted bluffs just as a bonus so there you go, Nathan. Those are going to be your lands. Hopefully, I'll see you uh, next chess club Thursday. If all goes well, I'll be there. So this box is yours. So let's get to the uh, other thing. <clears throat> so just as a reminder, yes, this is still part of my begathon. Uh, please subscribe if um, if you uh, if you like my videos. I know I know my videos are somewhat uh, boring in comparison to a lot of guys out there, girls too. But um, as I've said a hundred times, YouTube has um, given us this new mandatory one thousand subscribers in order to stay monetized. So, if you could help me out, that would be great. So, here we go. So, I was at Walmart again today. Needed to pick up some paper towels and, you know, some eggs and some milk and things like that. And into that same aisle, 
I picked up a three pack of Unstable. And of course, as you know, oh, how about that? It's eight o'clock. Okay, now that that's done, so as you know, what we're looking for, or what I'm really looking for, in the Unstable, uh, in the Unstable, of course, is the John Avon Full Art Borderless Lands. Now, we're guaranteed those, and we're also guaranteed the foil tokens, and some of those tokens are um, full art on the back, but what's really the lottery ticket of this particular set is the foil full art borderless John Avon lands. So, seeing as how I got a $110 card from Walmart by throwing a pack on the counter before, let's see if Walmart will will uh, give me another lottery ticket out of the three pack of Unstable. So here we go. Let's tear these open. I'm not, you know, I'm not even going to bother with the most of the cards. I'm just going to look at the lens, you know. I mean, I'll, I'll look through them quickly, you know. I won't just start. I'm not even going to show them to the camera. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, so after eight commons, I got a, an uncommon, so there must be something good in here. I don't remember, I don't recall only having eight before the, before the uncommons came. Okay. Old fashioned vampire. Okay, so my rare is the three headed goblin. Okay, that's fine. I'll just show you the rare. Okay, and we'll put that aside. And there's my full art borderless John Avon land. It's a forest. Okay, now let's see if there's something special underneath. And not really. And not really. And not really. So I don't know what the uh, deal is on the eight, you know. But uh, well, well, there's my uh, foil token. Okay, and the, on the back is the full art token. So that's what I got in this one. I I don't know what the deal is. I don't. You know, this is the unstable set. It's just confusing. I don't know. I don't know why there's only eight commons and then. I guess maybe because I got uh, three, no, I don't know. No, I'm just guessing at this point. Anyway, there's my two rares. I'll put them on top and we'll open up the next pack. Uh oh, uh oh, I don't want to do that. <clears throat> I'm losing my voice here. Okay, next pack. Looking for that foil flart borderless John Avon land. I'm going to go ahead and count them again and see if there's any kind of clue as to how many commons before the, you know, before the young commons. All right, so this time we have <laughs> a snickering squirrel. Okay, anyway, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Again, it's eight. Okay, so taking a clue from the last deck. I don't think that's anything special now. All right, midlife upgrade. <laughs> now that's funny. Coming from you know, I, I you know, I, I know you kids don't really come from an old man. That midlife upgrade is kind of funny to me. Okay, goblin haberdasher and uh, old fashioned vampire again. Okay, so my rare is rules lawyer. <laughs> Alrighty then. Anyway. That's the rare. Here we go. Cyborg advisor. Okay, so that's my rare and my full art borderless land. John Avon land is an island. Okay, so so far I got an island. I got a forest. And oh, this is different. I don't think I have this token yet. You know, the foil token, and it is full art on the back. I love me full arts. Give me some more full arts. Hey, come on, focus. 
Okay, guys. Okay, anyway, so that's that. All right. And next deck. I'm not going to sort these out in any particular way. I'm just, like I said before, I'm really after the, I'm really after the full arts and the, and the, uh, especially looking for that lottery ticket, the foil, full art land. So, third out of three packs. Cross our fingers and toes. I just glimpsed something foil that I didn't expect on the side. Okay, one, two, three, that foil is shining through, four, five, six, seven, seven, uh-oh, let me make sure of that, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, oh, there's something special here, it's not eight, it's seven, and I got up to the, after seven commons, I got up to the uncommons, proper laboratory attire. <laughs> yeah, me being the science enthusiast can get funny on that. All right, uh, teacher's pet <laughs> and uh, monkey something. Okay, the half monkey thing. You know, the, that's ridiculous. Set. Okay, so put those aside. What do we have here? Oh, okay. So we have the foil that um, popped up out of nowhere. Is an uncommon foil steam flogger temp it's a goblin rigger okay i don't know if that's worth anything so that was the special that was the the reason why there was only seven commons pretty nice pretty nice i'll take it i'll put that on top Oh, we got another, we got a rare is um, Angelic Rocket. Okay, whatever. That's my rare, apparently. Focus. Okay. And my forest, I mean my forest, my uh, full art borderless land is another forest. Okay. And then we have the uh, artifact contraptions. And this is what their trick is. Okay, so now there's only two. That's how they manage the seven. There's only two. That's how they manage to stick the extra card and There's only two contraptions. And uh, just a silly uh, token, goat token. Foil. All the tokens in this set are foil. Pretty cool art, I guess. But the back is just silliness. So, so that's it. Didn't get the uh, lottery ticket, but we did get three more full art on uh, borderless John Avon lands. And here's my beautiful face again. Let me get away from that mess. <laughs> Okay, so I'm a little bit further from the screen than usual because I'm backed away with this table here. Focus. Thank you. Okay, so there it is. And um, Nathan, I hope you're watching this video. It's just a spare of the moment video. The idea is that um, um, I'll probably yeah, I might even do a second one tonight on the on chess. Uh, I haven't decided yet. There's some chess subjects that I wanted to cover, but I haven't figured it out yet. But uh, this was sort of a prerequisite to getting a bundle pack of Rivals of Exelon, which uh, I decided not to get today. I don't want to spend any money that I shouldn't be spending because I got some other things to do, like car repairs and stuff. Um, but if I could get um, enough money or more than, more than enough money to cover the cost of a bundle pack by selling um, a game store other cards out of my collection then uh, I will do that and I'll you know I'm hoping I'm hoping to be able to do that actually um, so then I'll be able to uh, um, 
supplement my Rivals of Exelon because right now my entire collection of Rivals Exelon fits into into the uh, into the pre-release kit. I mean, I, I think you could even include the the rares that I have in the in the binder. And uh, so I need to uh, I need to up my game on on the Rivals. <laughs> But, you know, being the responsible adult that I actually am, or at least I try to pretend to be, <laughs> I shouldn't be spending any, you know, like, they're like $40 for the bundle. I shouldn't be spending $40 on something that I, you know. So if I, if I can uh, sell enough cards to make that bundle pack, I will. So, thank you for watching. Um, I'll see you uh, next Thursday, Nathan, I hope, at the Jess Club. And, uh... I'm hoping that you can build some decent decks out of the, out of the, uh, you know, cards that are. I'm giving you lands, you know. So I'm hoping that the lands give you enough cards to uh, build a decent deck, or two or three. Actually, you can probably build five decks out of these cards. Um, but if you build the 80 card decks that you're doing, you know. So I expect you should be able to build at least three decks with the lands that I'm giving you. So. Okay. Please subscribe, tell your friends, uh, tell your friends that if they're trying to also keep their, if they also have a monetized channel that they're trying to keep by getting their thousand subscriptions, if they subscribe to me, as soon as I see the notification, I subscribe back, adding another subscription to their channel, and hopefully we'll be able to help each other out that way. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you soon.